Amy Medford with Medford Knife and Tool. Knives on the table today are headed overseas to Waffenbach, Karlbach Gamble House. They are located in Hessen, Germany. The street address is Berliner Strasse 28. Um, yeah, so Waffenbach, Karl is uh, our, Frank is our contact there. Karl Bach is the extended um, information for the business name. So one again, once again, it's Waffenbach, Karl Bach, and the address is 28 Berliner Strasse, and they are in Hessen, Germany. And let's see what beautifulness is headed their way today. All right, so the deep are coming through after long at long last. This one here is sporting that blue and black composite G10, very smoothly contoured handles. It fits in the hand, just lovely. 20 CV is the blade steel. Uh, tumbled blade and hilt is integral. It is uh, snug into the blade. Wonderful fit and finish on this. Just like our other fixed blades, it does come with its own tech lock, hand formed kydex sheath. So one deep. We have a micro T S45 tumble drop point blade, blue handles, standard silver hardware, and clip and breaker. Victorian T S45 tumble drop point blade with faced and solar flare galaxy flamed handle. Again, standard hardware tumbled spring and a brushed and flamed clip. The second Praetorian T is a much darker version. So PVD drop point handles, breaker, and brushed and flame clip with flamed hardware. We have a single Praetorian tie. These do not go overseas very often. So I'm sure this is a uh, very rare commodity. S35 Vulcan Tonto straight up tumbled handles with PVD hardware and a flamed clip. Super sexy and very straightforward. Then we have a USMC fighter flipper with a DLC coated blade, PVD hardware, breaker, and clip with tumbled handles. And the second one is very similar to the first except for bronze handles. So both PVD blade, actually DLC blade, PVD hardware clip and pommel, and then one with tumbled handles and one with bronze handles. So there you have it. You'll see that most of our knives that head to Germany have very similar fit and finish. I'm sorry, so I was gonna say simple, um, not too complex. The colors are typically pretty muted, uh, lots of tumbled and bronze, um, and you know, not too much over the top. And I can appreciate that. It keeps it pretty simple. Uh, and that way all the customs and duties and taxes that uh, one has to invest in getting the knives over there isn't lost on all of the other custom upgrades and still the knives are beautiful as you can tell. So reach out to Waffenbach in Hessen, Germany. Keep watching the videos and until the next time, peace.